Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome back. So I've been practicing. I tried making a local server here. It doesn't work. So we're not going to play on that one. I practiced on this server up here, the Mind Your Mind, the original crash landing. That thing has gotten so overloaded with people that the lag's ridiculous. So they made a new server, Crash 2. And as you see, Crash 2, yay. So we're going to go there and see what happens. Hopefully it's up and running. Yes, it is. Start out at the airport with, whoa, pretty. Look out the way, yeah, run into glass divider. Look at that. They, all this just for the login section. The, the cargo elevators and the airplanes. That was so awesome. Spawn, built by Revert Leaf. Okay, yeah, y'all have to check out him stuff because apparently he makes them. Look, there's another one back there. Here's the one we're going to get on. And it's going to take us to the wonderful world. Actually, as soon as we hit that pressure plate, we're gone. As you see, uh -huh, uh -huh. they affect us nausea, blindness. We can't go anywhere. And boom, we are here. That noise you heard was us crashing. Get it? Crash landing? You can actually hear the thing crash. So, yeah, let's get to work. Y'all y'all know how this stuff works. Get your wrench. Get your goodies. Whatever. Oh, good. That, that stuff is no longer affecting us. The, uh, the quest, obviously this is the, I don't know, version 2 you want to call it? But, yeah. They, uh, Oh, they already give you the locations. Awesome. So you can read that later. Uh, we just took those out of the wall. Boom. Got our reward. We're going easy because, well, that's just the way we are. We're easy. Look at this. Just first bunch of quests, you can rip right through them. Not that one. Um, no, because we didn't sift anything yet. Okay, let's make some dirty water real quick. I know. Let's fill our backpack. So this is your camel pack. You put regular bottled water in it. See, it's going up. Yay. Put more in there. Get it up to 100%. Throw it on your back. Now, that will keep you hydrated for the most part. It's not 100%. You will run out. The cold water is for your emergency drink cool down when you really need to cool down. Over here on the wall, they gave us a gun. That's right. They trusted us day one with a gun. We, we have to be able to load it ourselves, so I think we'll be okay with that. Right click, it comes up, you load it. The, the annoying part is, now if you right click again, look at this, this junk's already spawning. It's gonna be a, uh, a night we're gonna stay inside. That's what it's gonna be. Um, I'm gonna throw this glass up here. We're gonna make our doorway out of it. We're gonna expand it. Yeah, the uh, the monsters out there. It's it's horrifying and scary. And I, I don't look, they even put the extra quest book away for us. This thing, this shell guy. Oh, and this let yeah, y'all gonna love this thing. We'll stick it right here. Uh, throw the power right beside it. Now when we right click on it, it'll take a sample of our DNA. Ow. Didn't hurt too bad. And then, oh yeah, we have to uh, hit our gear. Boom, there we go. So now that's sending power out the right side. And as you see, the progress is going up. Yes, yes, yes. Um, yeah, we'll throw this down beside here. Let that charge up too. But we're going to wait for ourselves to build first before we draw power out of there to use in this. This is where you put your saplings or whatever your leftover greeneries. Throw that in there. It'll fill this tank. Then you can put your empty bottles in there. 
and go back. You remember that from before. Wow, there's a lot of extra sand laying around, huh? So yeah, we got a, a little bit of food they gave us, so that's good. We've got our water. Um, we, yeah, we got to make our dirty water for the quest. Knock that. Yeah, it's only one. There you go. Throw this extra stuff away. Get out our sifter and our crafting table. Yeah, you hear them. They're all over tracking us. We have a nice radar, though, so that's cool. Um, yeah, we'll put the sifter right over here. Yeah, some of these blocks you can just punch them with your hand. You don't need a wrench. These uh, glass blocks, you're not destroying them. It's just picking them up, breaking them up. We'll, uh, we'll use that for our, uh, our doorway when we uh, get a chance to go outside. You notice it's uh, quite dangerous out there already. Well, uh, we'll manage. We'll be all right. That spider is going to be right on our head. We try to walk out here. We have the gun, but we don't want to use that. All right, throw that back up. So, uh, so we can sift a little bit. We got one quest we need to turn in. We need to get us a little bit of uh, what were they looking for? Salt. Yeah, we need some salt. Then we're going to run out here. As soon as the sun comes up, run out and run over by where the zombies were because we need some zombie flesh. For, uh, for, uh, yep, turn this one in. Get our dirt back. Obviously, that one's easy to turn in. All they wanted was a water bottle. And they give you back a cold water bottle and four empties. Yeah, before you'll know it, you'll have too many bottles and you'll have no idea what to do with them all. Get so many of them. Get all that cold water out of there so it doesn't get confused. We have our salt. So we did the first part of that one. That's this one over here with the zombie. Yep, yep, we got salt. Now we need some rotten flesh. Just one. So as soon as the sun comes up, we'll, uh, we'll run over there and... I'm sorry, I got distracted. Um, it looks like Katie's playing. Or should I say Dark Angel. But I don't know what server she's on. The one you're on? Oh, oh cool. So yeah, she's totally on the same server as us. That's awesome. Yeah, we should have put that in the wall, but... I don't know if we can break this stuff yet. Looks too difficult. So yeah, we're already got crap bags. We might as well sift this stuff while we got things going. And kick back and wait for the sun to come up. Yeah, that's cool. She has no idea what she's doing. She doesn't know she has to hold shift and then hit with a wrench to pop the things off the wall. So uh, step one, don't forget to hold shift. She uh, she put her sifting table in the doorway to keep the monsters out. That's pretty quick thinking if they were coming after her. Yeah, and then you click on manual detect. Yeah, y'all can't see it because this is the boring part, so I'll make you watch this, but you can listen to half of a conversation. So there's two choices, two question marks, easy or hard. So open your quest book and check it out. Whether you want to choose easy or hard. Right click on the quest book. Okay, sift sand, sure. Oh, hi zombie. Your gun's out there in the other room. Oh, she has her gun. Okay, did you load it? You you have to right click on the gun to load it. I don't know if she checked. Oh. If she got bullets yet or not. We got a bunch of ammo. We could go get us some zombies, but I don't want to. I'm scared. I don't want to fight the dust because I got a. Yeah, you all know I got a bad habit of. Uh, Run it out there, Brr, kill everything, and, well, ending things quicker than they should. So we'll, uh, we'll stick with what we got for now. Put, get rid of all.
all this extra. We're actually, we're going to start with the birch tree just to make sure. Um, it tends to grow a little, a little more. Uh, oh, how do you want to say that? Check on ourselves. Yeah, moving along, 72%. It, uh, the birch trees don't grow out of control. Like once in a while, you get those oak saplings, and they'll just, they'll just explode. They just go psycho on you. Yeah, we'll need that stuff later. We'll hang on to this bit of food. This is for playing with the doorway. Uh, that's our dirt and our saplings. Crafting table. Where do we want to put it? You know, we could put it right here. And then it's right next to and links with that chest. So we can craft things and have the chest right there. That'll be good. The spiders out here are just, just itching for a fight. You know me, I, I tend not to shy away from them things, but... Ow. Yeah, he took three hearts. We, we don't have any armor on or anything. We're, we're not being real smart here. We got our gun, though. There's another one up here. Yeah, shoot him in the butt. Shoot him in the head. Sun. Oh, the moon's almost set. The sun's coming up. There's our zombie flesh. Remember that quest? We need some zombie flesh. And we already went through one magazine. But hey, we got our zombie flesh. So that's another quest we're going to complete. Yeah, we're just going to block that off. We'll let the rest of them burn in the sun. We need the stuff, but not right now. Spider eyes. Make spider eyes soup with that. Use it some other advanced stuff. I need to see that spider on me. Yep, we'll just say hi. Burn. Burn. Why aren't you burning? <laughs> what is this, a parade? You keep parading them by? <laughs> Yay, one less zombie. Yeah, they, uh, they don't seem to have the, uh, the extended zombie mobs in here. Okay, so we can get out. As long as that skeleton doesn't come over here. We need to pick up a bunch of dust. And we need to block off... Our, our pyrene fuel over here. Now, personally, I uh, I prefer to come up over the top and behind it to block it off. It's a, uh, usually the safer way to get to it. Once you get it blocked off, it stops all the burning and stuff. So, But for right now, it's going to burn a lot. you got to get this covered up. Don't think it's not burning. It's see, it tried to get you. And then you walk out on this guy, and you slip him right in here in that gap. There you go. Drop one or two right here, so you can drop it down this side. Get that all nice and safe. All right, we're out of sand, but that's okay. I know. I called it sand. It's dust. Um. Now before. Remember I'd show you, we'd make that big old trench around it, and we, we'd spend all that time making a big safe perimeter. Well, I've come to find out that really wasn't as important as a lot of people seem to think it is. The, the important thing is, to find your level, what's going to be level? Right here. What I'm standing on right now, this will be ground level. So the important thing is, get your ground level, and just start leveling out in front of your place. And just keep expanding your level further and further. You know, right now, yeah, we, we could keep doing this for a while. We're not going to. And then, just below level, that's where I'm planting trees. And there goes the tree. I know. Look at me go. Boom, boom, boom. Boom, boom, boom. And uh, bone meal. We, we forgot our bone meal. We must have put it away. We'll, uh, we'll want some. Okay, we want a lot. So the first tree, boom, you grow it. Grab a piece of wood. Grab it, 
run inside, turn it into sticks, is what we're going to do with it. Make the planks, break the planks down, make them sticks, and then make yourself two crooks. I know it seems obsessive. It's like, why would you need two? You only need one worm. If every time I only make one, I never get the freaking worm. Never shows up. See, here, boom, I get saplings, I get worms, get all kinds of stuff right away. Because I have apparently two of them in my inventory, two of these crooks. Don't ask me, I didn't read the code, I didn't write it. I just play the game and that's what works for me. So yeah, you'll see all kinds of chat and stuff going on. Uh, right now, actually, my, my microphone is blocking me from reading the chat. So if you see something important, holler, right? Because I can't see the chat. So we're going to take this wood, and we're going to grow one more tree and chop it down too. And then we're going to go make some tools. That's right. This quick, we're going to go make us the Tinker's Construct tools too. Really? You can jump up and not get anywhere. See that? We already got our worm for that other quest. We got us some wood. No, more saplings. Gotta love it. Boom. Nice. Still gonna use the crook just to make sure we get plenty of saplings. Bust it down. Boom, boom, boom. Yeah, this one, because I've had plenty of practice now with the bad guys, and on this server they've turned off the, uh, the extreme monsters because apparently they're causing server lag issues and all kinds of other evil things that nobody likes. So we only have to deal with the, the regular monsters. So we're going to chop this one down. And then we're going to go make us some tools. We're going to plant a new one. What's that, Katie? Well, bring it up. Let me see your quest book. And you, uh, all right, click, click that. Go grab dust again. Um, and play reward, huh? So, uh, Uh, I will, I will, I'm going to help her for a second. So here, you all know how to make this stuff, right? See, save one piece of wood, make everything else planks. Save one plank, start making your other tools, your chest and your sticks. I know, that looks like a lot of sticks. It's okay, we don't, oh, you're right, we overdid it. We made too many. Because, uh, did we? Did we overdo it? I don't know. Let's find out. Apparently we can't make them upside down. So there's our first table. There's our stencil table. Oh, there's our tool station. What do you know? Parts builder tool station. Nope, we're okay. We haven't we haven't lost it yet. Not completely anyway. Get these down. You know me, I like these short, short tables. So I'm, yeah, I'm just going to throw them over here where I'd normally like to place them. Throw them, yeah, lots of patterns, I know, but you know me, we, we tend to use this stuff. I don't know. Get that. We need, uh, well, at some point we have to make a pick, right? We have to make a shovel. We make our axe. Uh, sword, we don't need that yet. No. No. Oh, that's that cross pattern for the quest. This is the other, the third piece for making our pick. And this would be the knife blade, which is for that quest. And a chisel and the tough. Yeah, see, we're, uh, we got it under control already. Just like that. Throw our bone meal in here. Throw, throw. Uh, yeah, you're right. Bone meal goes on the right. Throw the pattern over there. So we're going to make a pickaxe, and we're going to make that other mattock. That's what we're going to make right off the bat. 
Okay, so I'm done with that. This is for the pickaxe. One more piece for the pickaxe. Boom, there. We can already have our pickaxe. Now the medic uses the handle with the, uh, the shovel tool and the axe tool. And then we're going to knock these two guys out for the quest. Right? Right. Okay, boom, boom. Taking our bone meal back with us. Oh, yeah, that's right. That's why we're going to keep that extra wood. So we had more gas to throw all these patterns and stuff that we don't need right now. We'll get to you later, Wormy. Don't worry. Yep, yep, yep. So many things to do. So many quests. Oh, we have to, uh, we have to take that salt. What do we do with our salt? Here's salt. There's our salt. Couple pieces of salt. Little zombie flat. We're going to go ahead and burn both of them since we don't want to tie up our inventory anyway. There we go. Now we can finish that quest. Boom. Gives us more zombie flesh. Worm wants us to cook a worm. We got to make an oven for that. And we got to make a bunch of tools. Got to have an oven to make them tools too. We got to cook some of that wood. So let's get back here to the parts. We wanted a pickaxe, which is like that, that, that. Boom. That'll help us uh, clean up the walls. We want a mattock. Because it, I don't know why. I don't know why, because it, it works for an axe, but it's a lousy shovel. Oh, I know why we want it. Because it has plus six attack. That's right. When we hit somebody, boom, we hit them. All right, we can go hunting zombies there. And, and all the other little goodies. Oh, bookshelf. Yes, put the books on the shelf. Well, we're, we're probably starting to get hungry. Maybe a little water. How's our water holding up? Food, not bad. We'll go ahead and eat just to keep that nearly topped off. We are out of water. All right. The shit getting real now. That's it. That's the last of the water. We run out of that. We're done for. So, we've got to sift a bunch of sand. We should have made a shovel. Why didn't we make a shovel? Let's go make a shovel. Because we need a bunch of sand. We already got the parts for it. Somewhere. Uh, all we need, actually, is the shovel head. Because we... Uh, 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 we have to make a handle, too. You're right. There we go. Handle, shovel head little bone meal done deal throw them up there there's our handle there's the head for the shovel if if you don't know what to make you can click on these and they show you what parts you need you can kind of guess there we go these crooks I don't even think we're going to use them anymore so we're going to go get... Oh, look at that. It's already getting dark. Keep them weapons handy. But we need some sand. And I'm already using the wrong tool. Look at how much faster we're getting that sand. I saw some more flames pick up over here. We, we don't want that because these creepers apparently can burn, maybe. I don't know what's going on here. Look at how bright this is. It's just lit up because there's some fire stuff going on somewhere. Some, something's causing lighting. But see, it's not too dangerous out here. Just keep an eye on that radar. You're just going along doing your thing. We already got a stack, almost getting a second stack. What we're looking for, we, we'd like to sift dirt. That's the easiest way to get the uh, cobblestone nuggets. But in lieu of that, uh-oh, uh-oh, creeper, creeper, boom! Yeah, he took a lot of health, but he didn't kill us. Nope, he didn't get us. See, I've gotten better at not dying. Look at that. We got two stacks. That's what we wanted. Clean it up our neighborhood a little bit. Yeah, you're right. I should get inside. Okay, we're inside. 
sand, dust, whatever, put something in there. Keep us safe. And now for the boring part. Hey, what we survived the first, well, we started out at night and we survived. And then we made it to the daytime. Oh, well, then sift more dirt. Did you get enough to make a furnace? So what we're doing is we're looking for those little bits of cobblestone. We take and sift a bunch of this, and then we'll get the little bits. Did you see? We had five in the chest. Let's see how many we have. Got two on me. Not near enough. So we need to make a furnace as quick as we can. See, you put those four like that, and that makes cobblestone. We need six pieces of cobblestone to make... I know, we should have that in our... Uh, <coughs> excuse me. In our hot bar, so we can see. So it takes four to make one. We need six. So uh, six times four, 24. So we keep watching them nuggets. We're up to eight. Once we get up to 24, we're going to stop. We're going to make that oven. We can't take a chance on dying. And then we're going to smelt the iron dust. We're going to turn the iron into bricks and smelt that. Yeah, we're at 10, 11. We need 24. Katie's following along nicely. Hopefully she's not going to, like, run out of water. You can't do that one yet. Oh, turn that one in. The dark one. Yes. All right, now do the next one. Detect. Manually. Yep. Claim reward. There you go. So she's following right along. She's, she started right after us. That one's a pain in the butt. We're not going to do that till later. you got to make some tools. You need skeleton. We need some skeleton bones. Who wants to hunt skeletons? Anybody? I know. We're up to 15. Woohoo! 16. We need 24. Yeah, this is definitely the boring part. But yeah, we're going to have to go hunt some skeletons. We're going to use a rifle for that. We don't have us enough wood yet for making any wooden armor or anything. Okay, so you already know what to do with the regular salt water. How'd you get salt water? The water thing outside. Right? Oh, she she stuck the water. Yeah, there's some water outside the house, outside the the house. <laughs> yeah, outside your spaceship that crashed and landed. That spaceship. Or airplane. I guess it was an airplane. Just like the airplane we got on earlier. Yeah, that's the one that crashed and landed. I got it. Okay, so, airplane crashed. There's water leaking out on the side, but it's mixing with the ground, and it's gotten salty. It's salt water. If you drink it, you will get dehydrated. What you need to do is probably purify it, which would be like you do with the dirty water, is put it in the furnace and cook it. Um, I'm not sure I'd have to look at the crafty thing to see just what you can do with salt water. But if Katie wants to bring up her menu before we hit 24, we can, uh, now she can uh, just put the mouse right over the, uh, the salty water and hit the letter U, and it'll show you what the use is for. Any I will tell you. Yeah, so all you can do is smelt it. Uh, and you know, I keep hitting that wrong button. All you can do is smelt it and make some salty water out of it. All right, we got our six cobblestone. We go to our crafting table. Keep, hang on to the iron, ditching this other stuff. Oh, more books? God, we're just getting all kinds of edumacation here. Hang on to that iron. Look at that, seven seconds. Right, okay, so now you take this, and you make 12 slabs. You only need nine. The other four, well, you need eight, I'm sorry. The other four, we're going to throw out on the front steps. So we don't have to jump. Now you got to put a furnace somewhere. Convenient. What's the matter? Oh, she she's got 
she's got problems with hers. She she might just have to kill herself and start over. It's a horrible nightmare over there. I, I wish you could see her screen. I'm sorry I didn't didn't realize she was playing at the same time. That that's enough. We only need two iron. Give me that. Give me one back. Then we'll just throw them sticks in there. Hopefully they'll be enough. So with those two iron, we're gonna make a set of shears. And you can drink the cold water manually. So yeah, that the the water bottles. If you have regular water, you can put it in your camel pack, no problem. If you don't, hang on to this cold water. Those will save your butt. And you just drink it straight out of the bottle. You're you're just that hardcore. So we got us some shears. Boom. Now we're going to shear them leaves. We'll do some more digging later. The tools in this mod, you can fix them yourself in your own hands. Look at that. Just put it in there with the material, just like you would the repair table. Very cool. Remember our plus six Maddox. Good stuff. All right. Let's see if we can't not let this creeper open the door for us. And you know what I mean by open the door. You know me and creepers, we uh, we tend to have issues. Come on, come on, got him. Spider up here, yeah, you're gone too. Whoa! We're just a killing machine now, ain't we? Oh, we got a zombie, sure, we we'll your flesh, we don't mind. A little salt on you, you're good to go. You can also hang it on the wall there, where we took the gun down from. Yeah, you can hang it on the wall up there, and it does real good. Remember, I said I was going to make some steps. There you go. Ta-da! Ah, zombie coming. Careful you don't let them catch you on fire. Or hit you. Oh, no! Oh, no! Oh, thank goodness they burned up. Skelly, we're going to shoot him. We're going to try and get them bones. The arrows, we need those two to reload, but... No. Oh, no! Yeah, Katie's getting... Katie's getting attacked by spiders. It's horrible. Oh, yeah, gunpowder. You need gunpowder, you need arrows, and the empty casings to reload. Now, again, they went back and went to standard mobs, so spiders aren't attacking us because it's daytime but if it wasn't they'd be on us so and no more of those crazy giant creepers scary you you saw the other episode where every other thing that came out of the woods freaking killed us yep sweet tree now now we're gonna make some serious water now we got these shoes going to town oh yeah Maddox does act as a weapon and an axe. Makes for a lousy shovel, but two out of three ain't bad. Yeah, we want all them goodies. We gonna make us some more water. We haven't run out yet, but we're getting close. Yeah, I'm not worried about it. Boom, let's get another tree going. And we're... I don't know if I said it or not, but we're going with birch tree because they don't grow psycho crazy on you. Like the oak trees can do sometimes. They uh, they just go, hey, I'm going to be a super 500-year-old oak with 10 million branches. See that? We, we can't be having that. The little flare-ups? No. No. We can't put up with that. Sure, we'll eat. <laughs> And some of that good beef jerky is starting to bring me. Oh, yeah. You're right. It does take a while to, uh, to make water. So after this batch here, we'll go in, stick it in the machine, and whatever the thing's called, and start making some water.
Yeah, the uh, the other server, like I was telling you guys, man, that thing was crazy. That auto save had come up, and that was it. You might as well, you know, take a potty break or something. Jeez, it just takes forever. So this guy, fluid transposer. First thing we do, turn off everything, because we don't want stuff flopping around the wrong direction or anything. Throw that whole stack in there, and it's going to make water for us. Once it's full, which it will take a hundred pieces of leaves to fill this up to the top. So we're good on that. Now we got a bunch of other wood. What else do we want to do? We want to make some barrels, because we like barrels. Probably want to make a couple chests for here and there. Because before you know it, we're just going to have stuff everywhere. Let's make a couple more. No, you say make the barrels? Okay. I don't remember. Did the barrels use logs or planks? Oh, good. It used planks. <laughs> so we're, we'll be fine. Make a few planks. Uh, we, we need to make some charcoal, too. We'll do that with the rest of the... Now, we don't need all six of these. We can... What am I doing wrong? Did I go at the bottom or something? No. Oh, yeah. There you go. Hey, look. Just enough for one more. Now, these we're going to set... Most people put them inside. I, I'm putting them outside. We'll put them over here, kind of out of the way. They, they take a little while to do their thing. And they actually generate heat. That's right. They actually put out a little heat. And, you know, this game's all about the temperature. So we don't want to be standing around. But they're going to make dirt for us. Dirt we turn into cobblestone and gets our plants and stuff for us as well. Nice little greeneries, you know, we like that stuff. All right, time for the pickaxe. Yeah, we're going to totally... It's our plane now. Apparently, we're the only ones that survived this crash landing. So go ahead and tear some stuff up. Don't worry about it. Especially these ones that echo. I think they make the coolest noise. Now, back over here, this seemed to work um, pretty well on the other buildings as well that I did. Cleared all this stuff out. Then I threw in some dirt. The water's right over there, right behind here. You see the light coming from there? Don't worry about that. I'm not, you don't have to worry either. These guys are a little harder. They don't make pretty noises, but we'll get them out of the way, too. This is it. This is the start of our garden. It's right on the other side of this is that salty water. We're going to make our garden out of that. Oh, look, we're getting a little dehydrated. Let's check on this guy. Close enough. We drained one of the power cells. How's our clone looking over here? Boom, 100%. That's right. It's us. We is there. So now if we die, we'll come out as that clone. And we'll have to make a new clone. But that's okay. In the meantime, we're going to suck this power out of there. Take these five. Hit that toggle to fill it up. Look at that power. go. It's going to drain that poor thing. That's all right. We'll make generators later. We'll get it all charged up. I know, this only lets us hand, handle one bottle at a time. Inventory's all full. Such is the life. Let's, uh... Let's get these chests down over here. Just for all this crafty kind of stuff. And all the building materials, we'll throw that in there. Yeah, that makes us feel better. We got us some water. Not the cold water, it won't work in there. But this regular water worked just fine. If you notice, it's sucking them down 25, 24. That's to bring us back up to 100%. 
or 98%, 98, 99. See, we're down here on the bottom left, 80, 81, 82, almost 82. We're still sweating a little bit, so yeah. So there we go. We're good. We're good. Got us our empty bottles back. Probably make a couple more. We're going to put this cold water in here. So. <coughs> Grab this other cold water. I, I don't even want to carry around all that. But we're going to put this stuff over there too. The wrenches, the tools. The books should be on the shelf. I don't know why, but why in the world we have... <coughs> I, I got the horrible hiccups today. Why I have that stuff on there. All right. We're doing good. We didn't even close our door. Look at how brave we are this time. Look at that. We even got some decorations. To put up. We'll put that up over the doorway. Let them know who's in charge. Right over here. Boom. I only got one bottle of water. Look at this. Yes, yes, yes. So, yeah, we're cooking right along. Finish off this, uh, this tree real quick. That grow on its own? Kind of looks like it grew on its own. Even better. I don't want to use up all the bone meal. You know, got to keep some to keep the tools repaired. And those bones, you need them for cooking and other games. Oh, we got to make that bone crook too, don't we? Got to get make some more cobblestone. Oh, yeah. We're doing good. Oh yeah, there we go. Oh, got to plant the new ones. And you know, we got that extra dirt. Why don't we, uh, let's see, they usually go too wide, so two more. Let's go ahead and plant another tree right there. Why not? One, two, three, four. Two for each, each tree. Leaves to go out in two directions. Because, you know, those leaves are important to us now. I know I'm not using my shovel, but that's okay. Because it's my world. So I can do what I want. These aren't going to really matter. But we'll move them out of the way. Look at that. That tree already grew. We need to get more of that iron. That iron. Get that iron going. It's probably getting, yeah, the sun's starting to go down. We... We need to block that door. And we just never... We need to make a door. That's what we need to do. Make a door and put it on there. That'd probably be a really good idea. Well, the sun's going down. I'm not going to go out and die. I'll make sure I'm recording before I log back in. And, you know, like, die. Okay. So we're going to go. We're going to call it good here. We spent a couple of days. Showed you quick and dirty how to get started, get things going. I mean, we're, we're fine for water now. We just, we got all these tree saplings. Look at this. These bottles are just going crazy. I don't even have room for it all. That cold water, boom, get out of there. Get these empty bottles. Throw that stack of leaves. We're going to make some more. Next time, we'll show you how to make those generators. We'll get that power hooked up. We're safe from dying because we've got our clones sitting right there. All right. All right, we'll call it here, and then we'll, uh, we'll get back with you. Record some more. I'm going to sift this through the night. Y'all have a good day. Yeah, you can like it if you want. I don't even care anymore. Click like, don't click like, whatever. Subscribe. That's... Only the cool people do that because they don't want to miss this odd interval that I use to make these videos. And, of course, everybody shares it with their friends so they can sit around and laugh together. All right. Goodbye.